Hi, welcome to Dr. Zakir Math. Find the area between the curves y equals x and y equals x square on the interval 0, 1. So what are the curves given? y equals x and y equals x square given, right? Let us sketch this curve first. y equals x is a straight line passing through the origin, right? This is y equals x, right? And y equals x square, which is a parabola which is projecting upwards. So this is a curve x square equals y or y equals x square. So this is the place both the curves are intersecting. So we are going to find the area between the curve and the line, right? This is the top portion and this is the bottom portion, right? So now the area is equal to what? Integral a to b, right? Which is top minus bottom dx, right? So now we need to find the common points of intersection, right? So y equals x and y equals x square. These are the two curves. If the left sides are equal, then we can say right hand sides are equal. So x equals x square. So which implies 0 equals x square minus x. Take your calculator. Go to mode 5 and then 3. So if you press this situation, you will get a, b, c. a, the coefficient of x square. b, the coefficient of minus 1. And then C is 0. If you put in the calculator, you will get X is equal to 0 and X is equal to 1. Right. So we got X is equal to 0 and we got Y X is equal to 1. What is the equation? Put in any one of the equation. We have Y equals X. So put X is equal to 0 in this equation. You will get what? Y is also 0. And put X is equal to 1 in this equation. Y equals X. You will get what? Y equal to 1 also. So, what is the point of intersection? There are two points, 0, 0 and 1, 1. So, this point is 0, 0 and this point is 1, 1. So, now we are integrating with respect to what? x. So, what about x limits? Starts from 0 and ends with what? 1. So, therefore, area is equal to integral 0 to 1, right? And what is the top portion? This is the line. Line is what? y equals x. So top is what? x and the bottom is what? The parabola x square times dx. So this equals integral of x is what? x square divided by 2 minus x cube divided by 3 and the limits is 0 to 1. Upper limit substitution 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3 and lower limit substitution is what? 0. If you put this in the calculator, you will get the answer 1 by 6. Thank you for watching.